14 minutes past 7 is what you're saying. That's, that's what I'm seeing here. Okay. You set the timer watch. <laughs> you don't did. know what it is. No. I don't know what it is. You take a look. Oh, uh, let's do it. Where's the timer? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, nice. 14 minutes past 7. There it is. <laughs> That's great. It's good, isn't it? I love it, yeah. It's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Alexander Marsh and this is my take on the classic free will routine and it uses a single tarot card. Now my friend Louis Laval loves tarot. Now he is a magician but this is genuinely the first time that he saw the routine. Take a look. I've got one card from a very special tarot deck right here in this drawer. Mm -hmm. And this is kind of, it's based on the classic, you know, rider weight designs. Mm -hmm. But they're kind of updated. They've got sort of objects, items, paraphernalia uh, in the image and these uh, objects on the back of the card here. You can see we've got a watch, yeah. a pen, and a coin as well. So we're going to need okay. those three items for this little experiment. Do you have any money on you? Any coins? I've, I've given up on money. You've yeah. given up on money. Well, I have a whole pound, and if you're very good, you can keep that. Ooh. And a pen. Okay. And we can use my watch as well. And in fact, with this watch, before we get to this, um, I'm sure you know, as you know, you pull out the, uh, the stem or the crown, and when you turn it, you can set the time you know, when you're changing it for British summertime, GMT, whatever. Yeah. So I'm going to hold it face down just like this. And you just turn that crown backwards, forwards, clockwise, anti-clockwise, as much as you like. And whenever you want to stop, you just stop. Okay. All three objects that we're using in this routine were chosen for a specific reason. That's because we can use the watch for the force, but also the pen is going to be on you anyway, and you're going to be using this pen throughout your mentalism performance. You're going to get people to write stuff down. Uh, the coin as well can be used for other routines. Uh, perhaps you bend coins, or you can play a witch hand with a spectator. Uh, so you're going to hold both your hands out like this over the objects, and I'm going to shut my eyes, and then you're just going to make some decisions. Nice and simple, okay? So I want you to bring down your left hand on any of the three objects in front of you. You can tell me when you've done that, but don't tell me uh, which object you've chosen. Okay, I've done that. You're done, so you're touching mm -hmm. one object right now. Okay, yeah. and now with your right hand, bring your hand down on any of the three objects uh, in front of you, any of the two remaining objects. Tell me when you've done that. Okay, done. Done? Mm -hmm. Okay, so the objects that you're touching right now, one is for you and one is for me, but I want this choice to be completely free and fair. Mm -hmm. Which object do you want? You can just pull it towards you, you can push the other one towards me. It's entirely up to you. Okay. Okay, you done? Yeah. Okay, now do you want to change your mind? Do you want to swap objects with me or with you or anything like no, that? No, I'm sticking with this. Sticking with this? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so you have the coin. Mm -hmm. I've got the pen and the watch is just sitting on the table. Yeah. So as you know, when you look at a tarot card, you see reflections of yourself and sometimes the future. Okay. And that's exactly why I chose this single card for this experiment. Because if I show you, you can see a reflection of yourself. Because you are holding the coin. <laughs> I'm holding the pen as the magician and the watch is on the table. <laughs> nice. And also, can I draw okay. your attention to the watch that's in the image there? You can see the watch is at a very specific time. What time, uh, what time is it? Where's the little hand pointing? The little hand's pointing. Specific time. Specific time. So it's pointing at the, the little hand pointing at the... The little hand's pointing at the seven. Seven. And the big hand I'm going to I'm going to call you out on this. The it's not it's 14 minutes past seven. 14. So you say like quarter past seven. If you it's not quarter. If past If you were seven, talking normally, you say like quarter past seven to a person. Yeah. 14 minutes past seven is what you're saying. That's there. that's what I'm seeing here. Okay. You set the time on the watch. <laughs> you don't did. know what it is. No. I don't know what it is. You take a look. Oh, uh, let's do it. What is the time? <laughs> on that watch. Yeah. Nice. 14 minutes past seven, there it is. Yeah, nice. Spot on. Nice. Nicely done, well, thank done. you. Thanks, man. And um, thank you for this. Oh, yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> oh, that's so good. <laughs> I love this. And what's great, like, you know, if, you, like, if you're using this walk around, like you've got, so let's say this, you can locate this on someone, you can then use that for your next trick. Yeah, you like all the this. stuff in play, yeah, yeah. for other routines. This is or... stuff I'm carrying with me every gig I do, mm. no, when, and whenever I leave the house. And you just put that in your It was really nice because I had all of the coin and as soon as you pick this up, 
and you said it's a reflection of what happened. And it literally was the magician. You were there with the pen. I had the coin. Ah, oh, nice. And then, depending on what you're doing with this, you could even do a witch hand routine with the coin, and Absolutely. it ends up yep. in the same hand as this. There's more you can add to it. Yep. And there's also, uh, there's also like there's these objects here. This is a different time as well, so you can then do a different oh, thing. Course. Heads and tails. Heads and tails. Uh, there's a date on there as well. You can do so many things with it. <laughs> oh, I love it. Yeah, nice. And I just got the time was 1914 as well. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's good that. I told you it was good. Yeah, lovely. <laughs> so there you have it. My name's Alexander Marsh, and this is Thy Will Be Done. <laughs>